A baby boy is recovering in a Florida hospital this morning after dramatic roadside rescue. The scene stopped traffic on one of Miami's busiest expressways, and it was all captured by a Pulitzer Prize winning photographer. Benita Nair shows us how strangers rush to help. Benita, good morning. Charlie Nora, good morning. The images in this story are heart wrenching. Yesterday afternoon, five month old Sebastian de la Cruz stopped breathing on the highway. He was blue by the time a group of Good Samaritans gathered to help his aunt. A photographer from the Miami Herald was in that crowd. These are his pictures. Pamela Rosseo cradles her nephew Sebastian and gives him a round of CPR on the side of the Dolphin Expressway. Beside her, Lucia Godoy, who had given the five-month-old mouth-to-mouth just moments before. Al Diaz, a photographer for the Miami Herald, captured these heartbreaking images. I look up and um, a woman pops out of the car and starts screaming, uh, my baby can't breathe, my baby can't breathe, uh, call 911. Diaz was driving on the expressway and pulled over when he saw the commotion. I ran out in traffic, tried to slow traffic down, asking, for, you know, looking for help, someone that would know CPR. So that's when Lucilla Godoy uh, popped out of her car. Godoy was able to resuscitate Sebastian, but moments later he stopped breathing. Godoy and a police officer sprang back into action. I wasn't thinking, really. I just hold a baby like if it was my baby, and I did what I thought I would do if I, my baby was in that situation. Godoy and Roseo stood alongside first responders, making sure Sebastian was safe. The hero is Lucila and, and the baby's aunt. I'm not a hero, no. I just did what you would have done, I'm sure. If you're there and, and you see what I saw, you would have stopped, I'm sure. This morning, Sebastian is in stable condition. He was born prematurely with respiratory problems. Charlie Nora, before picking up his camera, the Miami Herald photographer found a police officer and brought him to the scene. Benita, I'm so glad Sebastian is safe this morning. Thank you. What a story.